as I live and breathe. Oh, it's, it's really you. Codsworth? You're, you're still here. So, other people could still be alive too. But of course I'm still here. Surely you don't think a little radiation could deter the pride of General Atomics International? <laughs> but you seem the worse for wear. Best not let the wife see you in that state, hmm? Where is the missus, by the way? She's... in a better place. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car, the car, how do you polish rust? Stay with me, pal. Focus. I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were dead. I did find this hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. You're, you're welcome. Now, and I'm feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, sir!
family isn't here either. They're, they're really gone, aren't they? Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't give up, sir. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well, the people there have only shot at me a few times. Thanks for your help, Codsworth. Good luck, sir. You'll find young Sean. I know you will. I shall be here and secure the home. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You want to come with me, pal? Okay, then. Let's stick together. through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please!
Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. Maybe. Glad to help. Well, if that's true, nope. we could use some more goodwill. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. Please, go on. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Sorry. Sounds rough. <sighs> Thanks. It's good to meet someone who nope. really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, huh. well, we do have one idea. Uh, one good idea can make all the difference. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crash vertebrate up on the roof. Old school. Pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of Cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Can't be too hard. I'll see what I can do. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck.
pin. Out of bobby pins. Got somebody up here! Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy. Come on, I got places to be! I don't know what
Take it easy, mama. You okay? Fine, fine. Just quit fussing. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. Feelings mutual, Preston. You can never have too many friends. Not in the Commonwealth. Listen, when we first met, you said you were glad to help. Well, you did. And we owe you our lives. So here. Yeah, it ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled there. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I've seen it. And I know your pain. Okay. I'm listening. You're a man out of time. Out of hope. All's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. I knew it. Please tell me where he is. I need to find my son. I can't see him. Not clearly. But I feel his life force. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. A great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. Please, Mama Murphy. I'm working for nothing. I need more. Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here, he's hey. gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Over here. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here. Wait there. It's safe to move out. We're heading Come on. to that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hardly oh, hold turn on, hold on. Thing. Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June, it's time to go. Oh, okay. I'm sure Preston can handle anything we find until we reach Sanctuary. You coming with us to Sanctuary? Get the price we paid to get this far. Let's move out. I'll take point. Get close, everyone. We're right behind you, boss.
first time I've seen one of these things up close. I'm really glad it's already dead. Can't say I'm gonna miss this festering boil on the ass end of the Commonwealth. Uh, no offense if you're from here or something. <laughs> Glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama. Uh -huh. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. 
You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? My son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. Uh-huh. Shut up. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. There's still hope in there are Minutemen out there, somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out with the settlement? I can't help right now. That's your call. I hope you change your mind. Ready to help out? Enough. I've had word from a trouble. Uh huh. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, 